Dude, I cannot friggin' believe it. I just bought the new PGA 2K video game and it lets me play as the friggin' foreplay guys. Holy shit, that's friggin' bananas. It's so friggin' realistic. The controller vibrates every single time the boys are buzzing. Do they still have that special putting? What putting? Putting these nuts across your friggin' forehead, bitch. Ha 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 ha. ha. But seriously, I picked up the newest Mario Party and it let me pick KFC. Barstool must be licensing these. Coach Dogs was in my video game yesterday. Was it the new NCAA game? No, Pokemon Mahogany. So friggin' sick, I can't wait to play as the Yak Boys in Scooby-Doo 2K3. Holy shit, is that friggin' Scooby-Dooks? No, it's Scooby-Dooky on your friggin' chest, bitch. Ha 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 ha. After Dave died and came back to life, things started to get back to normal around House Milton. The crew was back to their usual shenanigans. Kirk, I need your help, I think I have a new subject that you can use for the case season 2. I really really need you to crack this case. It has gone unsolved for too long. What's the case? There's a longtime associate of Barstool, whom I've gotten word, that somewhere out there, in the solar system of OnlyFans, there is footage of his cock. Kirk, I need you to find me that dick. What's the subject's name? The big man on campus. Jeff Nadu. The only thing I ask, is that you please, please, hide any and all of your women. Because he will steal them. Please, Kirk I beg you, do not bring any women, I heard he just got a new haircut. Dave. Listen to me. I will find that cock. Hello, ladies. Lego generic hair model number one, just how you like it. It's perfect, thanks. During their downtime, the usual suspects were up to their usual antics. Hey man, I'm a really big fan of your work. Do you think by any chance I could get an autograph? Shame. 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 Without a common enemy, Portnoy began to lose control over his army. And then in 7th I have the Cowboys. And lastly, coming in at 8, I have the Baltimore Ravens. Alright thanks Big Cat, we'll make sure to fade those. Stu, can you give us your top 10 rankings please? Ready to motherfucking roll! Here are the Stu Finer top 10 rankings! Coming in at number 1, we have Megan making money! Okay. And the number 2 spot- the crew was not prepared for the catalyst that would ignite the next major war. Baseball. How poetic, the one that coined the term baseball of fans. Hey guys, are the Houston Asteroids playing tonight? Has now become the biggest baseball of fan. The exit velocity of your Don Alvarez coincides with the BABIP slugging percentage plus war per 9 innings above defensive efficiency ratio is exactly why I'd put him in the two hole for tonight's game. Tico, where did you get that Houston Astros jersey? Dave let me borrow his throwback Jeff Bagwell jersey. Apparently, he's a huge fan. Federal crime. Taco Texas went on to become the first female manager in the history of Major League Baseball. This shit is lit. Tensions were running high as a war for the Pardon My Cheese Steak Throne was brewing. People were doing anything they could to get an advantage. Alright this one is for Team Nightmare. Which NBA player had the 27th most 3-point attempts in the 2007 season? Hum. It's not Chauncey Billups, is it? 
It can't be Chauncey Billups, right? Need an answer. Let's go Chauncey Billups. Correct. Much like the fabled Excalibur sword being pulled from the stone, it is said the power of the Pardon My Cheese steak throne is granted to the one who is able to pull the hat from Bald Paul's head. Many have tried, but none have succeeded. But this time, it was different. 